Today we're going to do something just a little bit new. We're going to call it pass fail. So I'm just objectively going to give my uh, pass fail on each of the little trips that I take with the car. And uh, you determine what you think if it passed or failed. Uh, it would be everything from um, making turns, changing lanes, etc. So without further ado, here we go. We will back it up, and the first uh, trip we'll make, we're going to make, uh, we're going to go to Little Park, which I always do. We'll make some left turns and some right turns, and we'll end up there. It will all be in a residential neighborhood, uh, so there'll be no change in speed limit. It'll be 25, and let's see how we do. There'll be a speed uh, hump up ahead here, and so you could see that uh, we're on now. And there's the speed hump, it shows it. And it does slow down always to 19 when I get to a speed hump. So I'm gonna make a right turn here. And this will be the per first pass fail. Uh, it's rolling up to the stop okay. The signal is on. It's looking left, looking left. There's nobody coming on either side, nobody at all coming. And um, I'll give it a pass, but reluctantly, but I will give it a pass. Uh, reluctantly because it took way too long to make a turn with zero traffic. Here we go again. We're going to make a right turn here at this stop sign. And then after that, we're going to make uh, several uh, turns in a row. So here we go on a beautiful fall day, by the way. So there's a pedestrian straight ahead. And let's see, he's going to cross the street, and I know that this car is very safe. You can see that it sees the crosswalk. It sees the pedestrian in the crosswalk. So he waved, he's happy, and I would give that a passing grade with honors. Uh, really good. We're going to make a left here. Now turn left onto Gundula Drive. And he, let's see how this left goes. It moved a little bit to the right, but that's okay. Nice turn. It's another passing grade. We're going to make another right, right here. Turn right onto Ridge Cane Road. And here we go. And another passing grade. There's a car on the right. It did great. Awesome. Now it's going to make a dog leg to the left. And typically this has been a minor issue. Let's see what it does. It stopped. So that is a fail, a definite fail. And now it makes uh, the turn. So it was a street that simply had a, uh, a dog leg in it and it stopped uh, even though it showed what it was going to do. Uh, we're coming to a three way stop. And here on this three way stop, it was a nice ride. Um, here we go. We stopped, and there we go. Perfect, it's another passing grade. Here comes a car, and let's see if we move over to the right. We did, we moved over to the right. I give it a pass for that, and uh, passing. And then we're gonna end our trip right around here, and I'll put in uh, our next trip. So that was a good trip. And here we go. So this time, uh, we're gonna go through uh, again, uh, residential area but then we're gonna go on to a highway with a 50 mile an hour speed limit uh, so we're gonna make a few turns a lane change so a little bit more here uh, than we've done and uh, then we'll do two more drives after that and it'll give you a, a good feeling so here we come to a, a three-way stop I have not been pleased with 10.4 so far. Uh, it appeared that I had just a lot of small things happen that were uncomfortable. Nice stop, passing grade. So, so far I'm very happy uh, with this drive. Still in a residential area. Uh, we're gonna come to a stop sign. We're gonna make a right, come to a four-way uh, stop and make a left, and then the fun begins. By the way, I have the setting uh, for FSD on assertive. Now turn right onto Malone I used to have it on uh, the medium one. So here we go. I'm making a right turn. There's a car coming on the left. He's got his right blinker on. So he's going to make a right before he gets here, but that's okay. We're stopped. And uh, here we go. Still waiting. Still waiting. 
checking. I'm going to give it a fail. Way too long. Had someone been behind me, I actually would have had to go already. Uh, we're going to make a left turn here at this four-way stop. Uh, since it's a four-way stop, we're going to cross over. Uh, but as of now, you can see there's really no traffic here. And there it goes. Nice. Nice, nice. Now, it has trouble on this particular piece of the road because it's so wide up here. It kind of goes back and forth. Let's see what it does. So it's, it gets a passing grade for that left turn we just made. We're going to come to a traffic light here. We're going to make a right turn at that traffic light. And if I remember right, it has never made a right turn at this traffic light unless it was green. So here we go. We're in the right turn lane. I like that. Signal is on. Uh, we stopped a little bit hard, but that's okay. Not a problem. Uh, there's traffic coming on the left. And we're easing out. We're easing out. And we have a green light, so it's going to go. Uh, I'll give it a passing grade, but I wish it would have, uh, the light would have stayed red longer. Uh, the next issue is uh, changing lanes. So we're going to make a left turn in a mile and a half and uh, typically I would like as, uh, I would like it to change lanes well in advance of, uh, of getting there but it doesn't it usually waits until it's about three tenths of a mile it uh, changes lanes giving a lot of traffic a chance to catch up with me number one and then number two when it makes a left turn we'll see what happens it waits so long uh, that I had traffic actually beeping at me and uh, it put on a blinker for some reason and then shut it off so traffic is now catching up with me from behind and uh, I we have uh, nine tenths of a mile to go I'm gonna speed up a little because uh, this has become a big issue in the past when traffic catches up with me and uh, this guy is gonna catch up with me rather quickly I am now seven tenths of a mile see and it should I'm gonna make a left turn and it's just waiting way too long and this car is actually gonna catch me I think I'm half a mile four tenths of a mile and in a second it's going to uh, change lanes and here it goes now it wants to change lanes and here's a car beside me so that's that's a fail to me uh, that's a fail now we're gonna make a left turn here and let's see what happens here it's the left turn lane now we did not yet we did not yet we did not yet we did not yet we did not did not and look at this I'm in the middle of the street so that is a fail and I'll go ahead and do that and once this traffic clears that'll be the end of this drive welcome back to trip three of four uh, this one is going to have some a uh, little bit higher speed lane changes again uh, one traffic light and a bit of a uh, confusion in a left turn uh, that I've seen before so let's turn it on see what we do we're we're exiting a uh, local area and we're gonna come out eventually to a traffic light where we're gonna make a left turn typically instead the car has to make a left and a right and what it has been doing is making the turn from the left lane and then having to try to figure a way to get over to the right lane to make the next right. Uh, so let's see what happens. See, here we go. It's changing lanes. It's going to get in the left lane, uh, though I don't know why it's getting in the left. Oh, it's getting in the left lane to make a left turn, even though the second turn is a right turn. So this to me is a this happens on almost every street uh, that I use almost every one and we stopped for a red light here we go so I'm gonna make a left and have to follow it up with a right you could, I don't know if you could see but there is a car right to my right already so let's see what we do and we're slowing down 
speeding up I have to make a right turn up ahead and I'm gonna have to I have to cancel I think you'll agree that's a big fail so waiting to do a lane change is an issue uh, it has been an issue uh, making a, a, a turn uh, from a left lane turn uh, to another lane turn where you're going to make a right after that, as confusing as that sounds, uh, it always causes the confusion I currently have. All right, I'm going to make a right turn here onto a 55 mile an hour uh, road, and uh, it's going to slow to uh, 45 after that, and then I'm going to make a left now turn up a road. couple miles. So let's see what happens. Here's the right turn, and we get a passing grade on this. That was uh, one of the better turns, by the way. So the speed limit here is 55. This lane is going to go away and become an exit only uh, shortly. Uh, you can see it shows an upcoming lane change. I'm gonna be real, uh, there it is. It's making lane change one. It's gotta change twice. So this was pleasant uh, that that happened. So I'm gonna have to change one more lane look at this so I am over a mile away and it changed lanes this is great and extremely encouraging In one mile, turn left on so now we're going to slow down a bit uh, to 45 so that's nice so it's taking me down to the speed limit by the way I've had to put air in my tires we got our first couple of cold uh, evenings and I woke up to uh, low air uh, tire pressure. So how many of you are going through that this time of year? So I am now uh, six tenths of a mile from a left turn. This left turn could be difficult. It just could be difficult. If there's oncoming traffic, the car has, the last time I did this, did not do well uh, in making the turn. It actually just sat there. Uh, so let's see what happens. The road I'm gonna go on is not high traffic, but the one I'm gonna cross is. So here we go, I am three tenths of a mile. It looks like there's a lot of oncoming traffic, so I will be uh, sitting here for a little bit. Uh, let's see how it works. I am two tenths of a mile, so I should be getting ready to put on the signal. You can see a car in the left lane up ahead. And here we go. Now turn left onto Billy Road. So here we go. We have uh, paused to make this left. There's going to be a mail truck coming. There's traffic coming. There's a car in front of me. There's a guy on the left. Oh, wow. It was trying to go around that car. Did you see that? Uh, that's a big time fail, I think. It was actually going to... It must have thought this car was stopped and therefore was going to go around it. I now have traffic behind me. Um, this car is not doing a very good job of turning. So let's see here. And it was a little more assertive there. Uh, I'll give it a pass on that turn. I do not give it a pass when it uh, tried to go around that stopped car in the road. I'm going to go through a residential neighborhood come out, make a right, another right into a high speed, cross over to make a left to get on a state road that's uh, fairly traffic heavy, uh, where we'll have to merge. So a little bit of everything on this particular drive. Uh, it's actually doing really nice in this neighborhood. It's uh, making the turns, it did a dog leg. Uh, so it's doing everything uh, here very nice. It'll go around this car, there you go. Onto Parterre Place. And here we go. We're going to have to go around this dumpster. Now and it right did. Parterre Place. And here we're going to come out. This is where we started. Okay, now I'm going to make another right, and then another and right, right, and then have to cross lane. over several lanes. So let's see what happens. Uh, I can't see on the left. There's a fence and a tree. It's crawling out, crawling out. It's looking nice. Nice, nice. Passing. That gets a passing grade. 
going to make a right turn here. Uh, this one might be a little bit difficult. There should be oncoming traffic from the left. Uh, and it stopped for no reason right there. Hard stop. Now there's no cars at all coming. I'm sitting here. I have a car coming up behind me. No cars coming yet. And here come some cars. I would give it a passing on that. I wish it had done it sooner. Change lanes immediately. Best ever. Way to go. So another passing grade on the lane change. Now it's going to make a left turn and cross over a highway to go onto a state road. Let's see what happens with this. This one the other day, I got stuck in the middle of the road and had to quickly scramble. So here comes a left turn and we're in a left turn lane. That's good. Now take the Kentucky the signal is on. It's going really fast. Uh, and it stopped quick. There's cars coming and now I'm okay. Nice. Passing. 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 That That is where I got stopped. The car stopped the other day. It certainly just made up for it in uh, what was more of a, of a assertive uh, move. Now we're going to merge here. We're going to stay on this road uh, and take the first exit off it. So let's see what we do here. So we're getting ready to merge uh, with traffic. And our signal is on. Wow, did wait till the last uh, second to make this merge. So here we go. Now, I'm hoping it doesn't try to pass this car in front of us, but it might. Uh, we're uh, less than two miles from the exit we're gonna be taking. Uh, though that car is speeding up at least a little bit. And here comes another car passing me. On, a, on an interstate, I would have expected, and it is going to change lanes. This is, I could tell this is going to get me in trouble. I could see it already. So we change lanes. We're not catching that car. We have to make a right to get off of this. And we're, I think, going to go back in that lane. Good. Uh, that's a passing. <laughs> passing because it changed lanes when it should have the car was going slow the car sped up and it went back into this lane we're gonna have to get off uh, that was really good uh, this general this person has slowed down again cars not trying to change lanes and it shouldn't so good good for good for this so 10 point point four I'm a little bit uh, feeling better today than I had been about you Okay, here comes our right turn. So we should get a uh, signal, move into the right lane. And at the end of this street, there'll be two right lanes uh, to turn from. It, what I should turn from is the one on the left. Let's see if it does that this time. So here we go, there's two turn lanes. I want to turn from the second one, and it is... Not going to do that and it's going to make this turn really difficult by the way because this lane is going to go away actually is the issue I don't know if you can see but there is a line of traffic now behind me that goes quite a ways back uh, on the road here here we go let's see what you do so never put on a signal uh, slowing down and stopping and I don't know if you heard the people beeping behind me so I will do that let's get out of this lane so that was bad that's a fail uh, in a couple of ways uh, one is it was in the wrong lane Two was it stopped for no apparent reason, which happened a lot in 10.4, to me anyway. Uh, now I'm going to make a right turn coming up. Here we go. We're a tenth of a mile. And I'll tell you when to, here's where the turn begins now. And still haven't turned. Now, I, now we got into the right turn lane. Our signal is on. It's making a seamless turn. 
So I think it was a fail to get in the turn lane, a pass to make the turn. We're going to make a left here. Now turn left onto Snaffle Road. So we moved over to the right for some reason to make this left turn, but that's okay. And here we go. No cars at this four-way stop. I have made the left. By the way, I have had more cars beep at me since 10.4 than ever before uh, that are behind me. Here we go. Now I there's a speed hump coming. So I'm doing 25 and it actually just saw the speed hump. It typically sees it sooner. Now I'm going over. This is the first time it made this dog leg to the right. First time. Here's a speed hump. Never slowed down much for that. There's another one right ahead here. I expect it will slow down for this, and it did. And there'll be one more. So, pass or fail, guys. What do you think? 